welcome to this episode of Video Drone by DIY3DTech.com. In this episode, we're out here on Lake Huron. We got the Solo. We've acquired satellites, and I got to tell you, it acquired satellites quick, so I'm thinking this has the Rev B in it. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and uh, take it up and see what it does. Okay, so the motors are activated. I'm going to hold to fly. And uh, it's flying. So, it hovers a little bit higher than the. Uh, the Phantom, so it takes up a bit above uh, eye level, so it's up there. I've got the 360K or 360K, the 360 degree camera uh, running. So uh, what we're going to do is we're just going to kind of take this guy out, and I'm not sure the 300, the 360K camera is running because I don't see really anything changing on my screen. So uh, I don't know what we're going to be getting here. So I just want to take it, uh, let's take it up. It uh, doesn't move as fast as the Phantom, but I think uh, it, it's the mode that I'm in. So I'm up about 16, 18, 19, 20 meters. So it's hovering around. This thing really seems solid. I really, I've got a little bit of wind, not too bad. Uh, but uh, the video is not changing on it, so I don't know if the camera went to sleep again or how it's working with that HDMI output. Um, or if it's working at all with the HDMI output. So uh, we got a ship coming down. So I want to push this out a little bit further. And so I'm out there now about now closing on 100 meters. I still have really good signal with these guys. And so I'm pushing it out. And I'm now out there going on about 200. I want to take it up a little bit. And this is super stable. Super stable. I want to bring it back towards me. So far, so good. This is, seems to be a really stable platform. Again, no problems taking off, no problems gaining satellites. So I'm just bringing it back in. Again, video's not updating, so um, I'm not going to get too crazy. I'm not sure exactly all the functionality of this app. I thought uh, I thought I would have um, some sort of map, and I don't see the map. I thought I had a map on it. So I want to bring it down a little bit more. And uh, I'm just going to do a short flight today because the camera is not working. But so far, I'm impressed. really steady. It's like an oversized spark. So I'm going to see about bringing it down again. Really steady. So I'm going to bring it down. And I'm going to land it Look how steady this thing is. This thing is this thing is unbelievably steady. I'm shocked. I still got tons of battery life, but I'm gonna bring it down. Because I want to mess around with some things a little bit yet, but look at how precise that is on its landing. I'm just messing around with it. I'm gonna sit down right on the right on the top. Unfreaking believable. So, anyways, that was the first flight. I'm gonna try some more flights, but uh, for this initial one, I just wanted to get some time out over the water, see how it handled. This thing does great, folks. So, so far, big thumbs up for me. So, I wanted to get a first flight in there. 
This is the first flight. I need to check the camera stuff on it uh, before I go any further. But uh, anyways, big thumbs up, and hey, we'll catch you guys in the next video.